All right, guys, here it is. Finally, after 14 months of waiting, the Mike Bruns built 3.6 engine. Look at this thing. It's a thing of beauty. Carbon fiber engine shroud, powder coated valve covers, powder coated fan shroud, powder coated fan. I mean, twin plugged JB Racing twin plug distributor. Look at this thing Look under here. Stainless exhaust uh, headers, powder coated lower valve covers. Just everything's been done. It's a GT3 crank, GT3 um, oil pump, uh, Carrillo rods. JE pistons, Elgin cams, 50 millimeter PMO carbs, everything new and ready to go. It made 360 horsepower and like, was it 300 torque, 290, 280 torque. So it ought to scoot, but it's been 14 months in the making. Here's the tranny, all gone through, all seen to, all sorted. Clean and I mean look how clean it is. It's not a spot of grease on it. It's beautiful. So yeah, that's it, man. This thing is ready to rock and roll. I'm taking it right now to Speed Syndicate. They're gonna do the install for me. They've got the car over there for some suspension work. It's gonna get corner balanced and lowered and aligned because it got all new suspension there's the dynamax uh muffler 125 bucks and it barely lost any horsepower compared to a gt3 cup muffler like maybe six horsepower loss so gt3 cup muffler two grand dynamax 125 bucks it's not the prettiest but i know which one i chose and uh so i'm interested in seeing how it sounds but Look at the, some of the details in there. Carbon fiber engine shroud really makes it pop. I just picked it up about 20 minutes ago from Mike. There's your Wevo transmission uh, mounts. So this thing is ready to rock and roll and I am so excited. 14 months of payments and buying parts and research and powder coat work and blah 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 you name it man every time i turned around it was a grand 1500 two grand <sighs> it was a big ordeal but it's going to be well worth it this car is going to uh it's going to be a fun car so i hope you all follow the build and follow with me because we're going to be trying to do some events with this car I want to get it out to car week in monterey maybe uh left the colt loop the colt if i said it right maybe next year so that's it man big old 3.6 out of an sc block who would have thunk that a 997 gt3 crank would fit perfectly in there so yeah Stay tuned.